Today we're going to make a neuron out of some clay, a straw that we cut in half, and a little tiny pom-pom ball. So you're going to take your clay and cut it in half, and then in half again, and this one half, you're going to roll it into a little ball, and press it together. That is going to be the body of your cell. So we're going to put that aside for now. Then we're going to take this other half that we made, and one of the straw halves, and start making our myelin sheath. So this straw is going to act as our axon, and so we're going to myelinate it, or insulate it, with clay as our axon on the paper plate. So then you're just going to keep on going down the axon with your clay and placing it at equal intervals all the way until the end. So then you're going to attach your soma or your body of the cell to the axon here and make a little connection which is called the axon helix. And then the pom-pom ball is going to act as the nucleus of the cell, or the brain of the cell. So now we're going to take our scissors and cut up the other half of our straw down the center. And this is going to be our dendrites for our cell. And so we're going to stick these pieces in the sides. We're going to do this again for this piece. And parents, you can help your children with this portion if they are not agile with their scissors. I'm going to stick them here. And once we're done building the neuron, we will explain what it does and what each portion you just built is. So you, then you can take the little bits of clay you have left over and roll them out into long little snakes like this. And these are going to be your synapses at the other end of your neuron, like so. And you're going to just keep making them until you run out of clay. So it doesn't really matter how many you make. And the same thing with these dendrites. You can make more or less if you choose. So now that we have all of our synapse, synapses made, we're going to label the neuron. So here is the body of the neuron. This is basically the instruction center of the cell that tells the cell what to do. This is where your DNA is housed inside of your nucleus, this little pom-pom ball. And here is where all of the genes are located and where all the instructions come from. Here are your dendrites. And these receive signals from other cells. So if you had a whole bunch of cells made, this end would be connected to this end in a line fashion in your brain. So these dendrites receive signals from other cells and bring them into the body, where then the nucleus tells the cell what to do with those signals. And then it sends its own signal down the axon. So this is the axon. And these spaces in between our myelin that we made with clay, the spaces are called the nodes of Ranvier. So I'm just going to put nodes here. And those nodes help the signal jump along the axon all the way down to our synapses where neurotransmitters are released into the surrounding interstitial fluid. And 
these are our synapses right here and those are exactly where it connects to dendrites on other cells so in between here and here on other cells that is where the signal crosses and this is a neuron 